You know, sometimes you're going to be your only supporter. Sometimes you're going to be your only cheerleader. And that's what we're talking about. Let's go! Yesterday, I was about going to smash my racket up. <laughs> but today, so much better. You know, I, I cannot stress enough how important it is to have this coach on my team. And like, I, I'm telling him to really push me. You know, he says he can uh, play even better. And I'm like, yeah, let's do it. Let's go for it. We'll play the game today. I won a game. I beat him in a game. Uh, just got to work on my serve now. And then I got to get match time, baby. I'm ready to play. I am ready to play right new. Let's do it. You got time to get ready for the next shot. Hopefully put more pressure on. Does that not open me up? Well if you think the ball's coming to you and you're leaning back, how are you gonna apply any pressure to them? Or your weight's going backwards. You can do either again. Backhand's changed the lot since my day. Djokovic, all that big play. Wow, I feel better after yesterday when it was a tough gig, yeah? Uh, back in with having a coach. So important having a coach, man. Why didn't I do this for the first part of my life in anything I'm doing? Yeah, so he comes back, straightens my serve up, starts smashing it, starts the slice, teaching me the left-handed serve, playing against the right-handed players. Um, what else? Forehands galore. Nikki, Nikki, did you see how he was doing it? Uh, I record it a lot. Yeah, yeah, but what I'm saying is you're going to be able to do that now every day, yeah? Yeah. So, Nikki's going to be my coach. Nikki is an awesome coach, by the way. Coaching me yesterday, saying, Come on, faster! <laughs> Come on! And she said, if you don't move, you're doing five squats every time you don't move for the ball. <laughs> yeah, two hours on Wednesday. Feeling good. I'm feeling good. I think we're not far away from uh, playing a game. Yeah, and we're keeping my 100% win record so far. But I ain't played no one yet of any stature, is what I would admit. Yeah, these don't even smell. It actually smells nice. Yeah, so right now, we are going, wow. We're going to be going live on the Real Life Game Changers podcast. We have an awesome game changer. I read his book. And his book is uh, called No Self, No Problem. Meaning, get over yourself, baby. And this is what this tennis game is all about. This is what business is all about. It's what life's all about, honey. Honey bun. So you guys better uh, realise that that's what it's about because this journey of me going to win Wimbledon is going to be valuable for many people to get in the mindset right. You know, what are you guys doing? Get in. Come on man, bedtime for you. Yeah, it's going to be vital to keep your mindset straight 
and keep your emotions rocketing and also when doubt sets in when the naysayers start telling you you can't do it when the naysayers start saying you're not good enough your goals are crazy don't be so silly that's when you're gonna have to dig deep that's when you're gonna have to find resilience you're gonna need the mindset you're gonna need the support you know sometimes you're gonna be your only supporter sometimes you're gonna be your only cheerleader now that's what we're talking about can you pull it out of the bag when all is against you everyone is against you everyone seems like they're against you that's the key let's see how this journey continues